Introduction to Compound Discount If the effective rate of discount is 8% per year, how much should be deposited into a savings account now so that in 10 years time, the balance of the account will be £9,000? We model the balance of the account at time 10 by the cash flow 9000 at 10. The balance of the account at the beginning of the first year is then value of I of 0 at 9000 at 10, which we are able to compute as we have not been given I, the rate of compound interest paid at the end of each year. Instead, we have been given the rate of compound discount, which is paid at the beginning of each year. Let D be the rate of compound discount per year. The, this rate is related to the rate of compound interest per year by the property 1 plus i times 1 minus D is equal to 1. If we recall the definition of value, value of i and b of x at a is equal to x times 1 plus i by b minus a, then we can see how to proceed. All we do is we substitute Instead of using 1 plus i, we substitute. We use this um, equation to put substitute 1 plus the 1 plus 1 minus d to the power of minus 1. Let's take a look at how that works. Value of i of 0 at 9010, using the definition of value, is equal to 9000 times 1 plus i to the power of 0 minus 10. Substituting for 1 plus i. 1 plus i is equal to 1 divided by 1 minus d. So, we get 9,000 times 1 minus d to the power of negative 1, all to the power of 0 minus 10. Now, using exponents, we can see that this is really negative 10. And when you have something like this, you have x to the power of um, a to the power of b, then that's the same as multiplying these two exponents. So we get 1 minus d is to the power of 10. This is negative 1, this is negative 10. Multiply them together. Negative 1 minus negative 10 is 10. There we go. And then we begin d is 8%. So we have 9,000 times 1 minus 0 0.08 to the power of 10. By arithmetic, that gives us 3,909.50. So we must deposit. £3,909.50 now to reap £9,000 in 10 years time given this rate of discount paid yearly at the beginning of each year. If the interest is the payment required at the end of the year, discount is the payment required at the start of the year. Compound interest and compound discount are related by this one plus relation, 1 plus i times 1 minus d is equal to 1, where i and d are the rate of compound interest and compound discount paid yearly at the yearly respectively.